Hello, this is Cilo Kvetsky with a quick tip for CG Tuts. Now, this quick tip is actually about all these value fields here in Cinema 4D. You know, all these places you can you can just enter numbers. You can actually enter equations as well. So you can say maybe 200 divided by 4, and that's 50. So the way you can use this, for example, is when you're working in a project and your project uh, units are set to centimeters, right? Because metric system makes sense and imperial doesn't and it's nonsense you can actually maybe use you know some size that is in inches but you still want to keep working in centimeters you don't want to go to preferences changes to inches and then back to back to centimeters so what you can do is maybe you know this is 10 or 20 inches deep so what you can do is 20 times and you know that the conversion conversion rate between inches and centimeters is 2.54 if I'm correct so you just say 20 times 2.54 and we know that's 50.8 centimeters, right? So <clears throat> that is one way to use this. You can also enter way more complex, you know, calculations. So you can say like, I don't know, 50 or 40 minus 23, close bracket, times, open bracket, oh, sorry, open bracket, 24, times 1.24, close bracket, close bracket, divided by, open bracket, 30 divided by 2.8, right? Enter, and this number pops up. So you can just enter, you know, various complex equations. Let's say you want something to be, you know, five times bigger, so you just say times five. Or you can even say you want it to be four centimeters, right? And you don't want to click four times or, you know, uh, 50 centimeters bigger. So you don't want to click 50 times or enter 250. You just can do plus 50 and it's 250, right? That's actually very simple. And this tip should actually work. Uh, I believe it works in After Effects. It should work in all your, you know, 3D, uh, 3D animation applications. It, work, it should work elsewhere as well. But if you're maybe working in an application that doesn't have this, then there is a <clears throat> nice little quick tip for Mac users and that is you can actually use the spotlight for the same thing. So you can say 50 minus 4. And here you have that it's 46. And just the same as we did in Cinema 4D, we can enter more complex stuff. So 20 minus 50 minus 25 times 2 times 2.3. Close bracket, close bracket, divided by uh, whatever, 4, right? And here's your number right here. <clears throat> so I hope this will be very useful. I suggest you use this a lot and when you get used to it i i believe that it will be actually a good little trick you can use often and it will be very helpful so see you next time